Engineering and technology are major driving forces behind the UK's economy, and innovation is critical to these industries. Our science and research base is excellent, but more needs to be done to help UK SMEs scale up ideas for commercial success. Similarly, more needs to be done to help SMEs take advantage of government support schemes that they currently lack the time and knowledge to access. These are two of the calls that the Institution of Engineering and Technology is making to government across policy areas including energy, education, manufacturing, IT and communications, and transport ahead of the general election. Following the November 2014 report from the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, which confirmed climate change is happening, the IET wants the UK to become a clear leader in climate change mitigation and adaptation, fostering the development of new low-carbon technologies and resilient infrastructure. Equally, energy efficiency must move up the political agenda, with solutions ranging from home insulation to greater use of community heating. Reducing emissions from transport is also a priority. The future government should invest in schemes that reduce congestion and provide user satisfaction. Joined up thinking will ensure new transport schemes are part of a wider and connected transport strategy and don't end up as tomorrow's white elephants. The engineers and technicians of tomorrow will be encouraged by high-quality STEM teaching in schools and colleges, monitored by Ofsted to ensure it includes practical activities, clear engagement and exposure to real-world problems. To address the shortage in engineers, the IET wants the government to promote upskilling and retraining among the working-age population. The UK's future prosperity will also depend on how we handle cyber threats to our security and economic prosperity. The IET believes a single government department should drive a unified approach to cyber security, e-commerce, privacy and legislation fit for the 21st century digital economy. Reliable broadband is equally crucial to the digital economy. The IET believes good broadband access should be recognised as the UK's fourth utility and that the UK should become a global leader in developing and introducing the next generation of mobile and fixed networks. Join our call for the next government to ensure that engineering plays a central role in growing our economy and improving the quality of life in the UK. Follow us on Twitter at the IET.